Hi, how is your day? I've located the target. It's in the plaza in front of Iwatodai Station. This will be the tenth. Only a few left. But let's worry about them one at a time. Assuming they come one at a time. <laughs> Just kidding. Yukari-chan, how did you know? I sensed two of them. Are you serious? Me and my big mouth. Where's Shinji? He just notified me that he'll meet up with you later. I didn't, I didn't ask, ask any questions. questions. Figures. He's always played by his own rules. It's okay. At least he's coming, right? Hey, last time wasn't my fault. I, I was tied up. Not this time, though. I'm ready and raring to go. Wait, Ken Kun isn't here either. Hey, Junpei, go get him. That'll be your punishment for last time. Punishment? What, what is this? Kindergarten? <sighs> that little shit is more trouble than he's worth. All right, let's move out. This time, there are two enemies. We'll determine our formation once we arrive. Let's go, then. There they are! This is the way we go to school. We've got to protect this place. It seems like they've been waiting for us. Where's Amada? It wasn't in his room, so who knows? Damn it, Shinji, where are you? Um, I think we should hurry. They look like they're about to make their move. All right, let's decide on a team and engage the enemy. Once it's decided, we'll head over immediately. Keep you informed. Please be careful. <laughs> I don't detect the fortune one anymore. The strength one must have done something. You can't attack it right now. Concentrate on the one whose arcana is strength. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. Shut the 
depend on where it stops. Red is bad luck. I hope it doesn't come up. Come <laughs> on. 
finish it off. Persona! Fortune again, so you can attack that one now.
for this. Okay, now! Good job, everyone. Oh, man, talk about exhausting. This time, those two who call themselves Strega did not interfere. It must be because we have Chidori. Anyway, I'm glad everything went well. But what happened to Shinjiro-senpai and Ken? The chairman doesn't seem to be too concerned, so he went home. Yamagishi, where are those two? I'm sorry, I haven't been able to locate them yet. Let's return to the dorm, and then go from there. Akihiko, are you listening? Today is October 4th, huh? And? Just go back without me. I'm gonna go look for them for a while. Senpai? What's wrong? Akihiko. You came. I'm surprised you abandoned the operation. Do you know why I asked you to meet me here? Two years ago today, October 4th, that was the day my mom died here. They called it an accident, but it wasn't. I saw the whole thing. You murdered her! Since then, it's been one bad thing after another. And all I get from people is sympathy no matter where I go. What's the point in living? I even thought about killing myself, but Mom wouldn't have wanted that. That's why I decided that I had to find her killer. You! You said once that you wanted to forget what happened on that day. So when I found out it was a full moon today, I knew I had to confront you. Today, Mom is watching over me. I'll make you remember what you did to her. I'm gonna kill you! Do it. Huh? No one's here. Anyway, why was Akihiko-san acting so weird? What's so special about October 4th? October the 4th? Oh, that's right. I was so caught up in the operation that I didn't realize it. This is the day Amata's mother was killed. You serious? Yamagishi, I need you to find the two of them immediately. There's a good chance that they're together. Akihiko must have already realized that. I... I understand. Um, what's going on? Although her death was officially listed as an accident, we're the ones who killed Amada's mother. What? It was two years ago, when we were pursuing an unusual shadow that had escaped into the city. We were in a residential area, but the shadow was all we were thinking about. Aragaki was still new, and he momentarily lost control of his power. Unfortunately, there was a casualty. Amada's mother. No way. Are you shitting me? Then to Ken Kun Senpai is. Amada volunteered to join us. But now that I think about it. 
I found them. They're at Tatsumi Port Island. They're together, and another Persona user is nearby. Akihiko? No, it's... it's a member of Strega. That's not good. Ugh, it's an absolute nightmare. Senpai, come on, we got a follower. Okay. Do it. I won't stop you. You're right. I wanted to forget. That's why I left the group and tried to suppress my power. But nothing I did could erase the memory. And now I find myself here. The last place I want to be. It's my fault. This is what I deserve. But let me give you one warning. Warning? If you decide to take my life, you'll end up like me. Just remember that. Is that supposed to change my mind? Even if all you have now is hatred, one day you'll regret it. Shut up! That's a load of crap! He is correct. Huh. There is no reason for him to feel regret. That is the nature of revenge. Is it not permissible to kill those who are themselves killers? That... that's right. What do you want? The loss of Chidori has posed a bit of a challenge for us. But we cannot simply ignore your meddling. You bastard. Do not fear. This life is but a stepping stone. Salvation shall be yours. What? My. Trying to protect your would-be murderer? You cannot defy fate. Whether or not it comes at this boy's hand, you will die tonight. What's he talking about? You've been taking those pills for some time now. You don't have much longer. That's bullshit. Listen to your body. You know it to be true. Huh? What does he mean? You're going to die? No matter what I do? That's not fair! All this time, I've been waiting for this! The cause of death is not of importance. Besides, the breath of life is faint in you as well, child. After killing him, you were planning to join him, were you not? <sighs> Ken, don't. Since you are both destined to perish, allow me to do the honors. A slight change in timing shouldn't matter too much. Go to hell. Now then, with what life you have left, answer me this. There is one like Chidori among you, is there not? This has enabled you to locate and defeat those we wish to protect. Now tell me, which one of you is it? If you don't expedite your answer, then this will hurt you more than it hurts me. Uh. What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? There, there's no one. Wait! It's... it's me! Is that true? Yes. That's the only reason they let me join. Ken, no! Ah! Quiet. You had your chance. It doesn't matter anymore. I'll never have my revenge. I have no reason to live. I see. So you have achieved resolution. How enviable. Then you shall be first. Rest peacefully. Mom. <sighs> Huh? <coughs> <coughs> what?
What is the meaning of this? Why would you risk your life to save the child? Ah! Oh! Shinjiro-san! Shinji! <sighs> and now your comrades arrive. Is there any moment of joy they won't intrude upon? Perhaps another time, then. Shinji! Shinji, hey! Hang in there! <gasps> Shinjiro! Senpai! Shinjiro, senpai! No! Ken. <laughs> Why the long fate? Isn't this <laughs> what you wanted? It's all right. Give yourself time. Let your anger be your strength. You're still just a kid, Ken. You got your whole life ahead of you. <laughs> so don't waste it. Make it your own. Okay? But I... I... Aki. Take care of him. I will. Oh. Don't cry. This is how it should be. <coughs> the hospital. We, we need to get him to the hospital. Yes, let's waste no time. Uh, it's the dark hour. Until it ends, the doctors won't be... No. Then is he not gonna make it? Can I talk to you for a moment? Oh. Sure. When you get back today, please meet me in the lounge. You know what it's regarding. Yeah. I don't expect you to have collected your thoughts. In fact, I'm still at a loss myself. I'll see you then. It's about Ken, huh? <sighs> This'll be a fun meeting. Yeah. Hey, let's go home together today. Yo, you look pretty good. So how long are you gonna lie around sleeping there? I had the usual for lunch. Ramen tastes a lot better when you're cutting class. Make sure you invite me next time. <sighs> Say something, will ya? Why are you always like that? You're so stubborn. Put yourself in my shoes for a change. You think it's the other way around, huh? I guess you're right. I was too obsessed with power. Ever since I lost Miki, that's all I've cared about. I thought that if I was strong enough, I could protect anyone. But I was wrong. Now look at you. What am I supposed to do if I lose you too? Shinji... Don't leave me behind! You can hear me, can't you? Wake up! Snap out of it! Shinji! <laughs> yeah, I know. Crying won't change anything, will it? 
All right, Shinji. You watch from here. I still have things to do, right? I know that much. I can't carry this guilt forever. I'm getting tired of it. You all know the reason we're gathered here. We need to discuss how to deal with Amada. I've already consulted the chairman. I guess bring Amada here. Understood. It's my fault. When Shinjiro Senpai told me he'd be late, I thought it was strange, but I said nothing. If only I'd listened to my intuition. Don't be so hard on yourself, Fuka. It's not your fault. If anyone should have realized it, it should have been me. I knew this wasn't a game, but I never thought it'd end up like this. There's no point dwelling on the past. Don't you remember what Shinji said? This is how it should be. He was a hell of a guy. He even faced death head on. That's why from this day forward, I'll face things head on too. That's cool, man. Senpai. Hmm. Allow me to report. Amada-san is not in his room. He's not? There are indications that the window has been pried open. Ken-kun! Wait, Fuka, do you know where he is? Well, no. But we can't just let him go off on his own, right? So where do you plan on looking? I don't know, but we have to find him. He must feel so alone. But how? Where? You of all people should understand. Fuka, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Now let Ken do what he wants. Bringing him back won't change anything. And we can't keep treating him like a kid. Akihiko. It's his choice. He's the only one who can decide how he's gonna live his life. The same goes for all of us. <sighs> Thank you. 
You look half dead. What are you doing here? When Mom died protecting me, no one would believe the real reason for her death. To this day, it's still on file as an unexplained accident. That's why I wanted to make it clear. I thought that's what she would have wanted. Maybe then she'd finally be at peace. They said he was the victim of some violent crime. Right. No one knows the truth. Just like with Mom. And once again, I'll be left behind. You've been left behind twice. Did you ever think there might be some meaning in that? <sighs> I'm not here to drag you back. You can stay in this place until you die, if that's what you want. But if you still have the will to fight, then come back and stand on your own two feet. He's right. I've known it all along. I've just been lying to myself. I was consumed by hatred. I couldn't face the thought of being alone. But that's exactly what happened. All this time, I've just been running away. I've made up my mind. I won't run away. I swear that I won't run anymore. Shinjiro-san, I'll see it through to the end. So you don't need to worry. I'll be okay now, Mom. Goodbye. It's already been a day. Yes, it has. So, uh, where's Akihiko-san? He said to leave Cancun alone, but I don't know. Maybe we should look for him. What's your opinion? You think so, too? Well, he is still a kid. I can't wait any longer. I'm going right now to... Oh, Cancun! Oh, thank goodness. I was so worried. You were? Amada, are you able to fight? Yes. I, I won't run off again. Are you sure? Yes. It's all right. We can trust him. Jeez, don't make us worry like that, okay? All right. I'll talk to the chairman. Get some rest. Yes. It's cold tonight. Can you believe it's already autumn? 
It'll be winter before you know it. You seem tired. Did something happen? Is that so? In this world, people die every day. Until recently, this was the same to me as the blowing of the wind. But now I see things differently. For the first time, I have a friend. Lately, I've become more certain of something. You know the end I've spoken of? Some people refer to it as the fall. But regardless, it's drawing near. Don't you sense it? We are kindred spirits, you and I. So why is it that only I can remember? This is a heart-rending matter. Is my existence something you are unable to accept? Forgive me if I have said anything peculiar today. Perhaps it is the change of seasons. Of course, our friendship remains steadfast. Well, I shall bid you farewell for now. Good night. I'll always be by your side.